Let's look at the equilibrium constant for the auto dissociation of water, Kw. Here I've plotted Kw for water versus temperature. So what is the pH of pure hot water? Is that greater than 7, equal to 7, or less than 7? Think about that for a minute and make a selection. Let's look at a possible explanation for each answer. A, heating water increases ionization, so the pH will increase. B, pH is independent of temperature, so the pH will be 7. Or C, Kw increases, so the H3O plus concentration increases, lowering the pH. Think about those three and make a selection. We're talking about the pH of hot water based on Kw for water, the auto dissociation constant. I have it plotted here. As the temperature increases, Kw increases. So by the time I'm up to 60 degrees, Kw is 10 times as large. So if Kw is 10 times as large, that's 10 to the 13th rather than 10 to the 14th. And in pure water, the product of H3O plus and OH minus will be 10 to the 13th. So these two concentrations will be equal in pure water, and both of them 10 to the minus 6.5, approximately. So the pH is minus log of H3O plus, so minus log of 10 to the minus 6.5 is 6.5. So the pH in hot water is lower, hot pure water is lower, slightly more acidic or less than 7. And indeed, when you have a very nice pH meter, it will have a temperature dial on the front, so you can calibrate for the fact that Kw is a function of temperature. Hot water, lower pH than cool water.